Okay, so we can use Bing video codec for free with Unreal Engine 5. And it's much faster than MPEG-4 AVC, for example. So here is comparison. Uh, you can see I have uh, 100 FPS right now without any video playback. And now I'm going to start playing video. Uh, these are MPEG-4 AVC encoded videos. Uh, there are 30 videos uh, playing at the same time on 100 screens. And you can see FPS goes to like 60, 70. It's already significant drop from 100. And I can run around, uh, FPS stays same, relatively. So now I will start playing 4K video. And uh, these are 4K videos, and you can see FPS dropped below 30. It's like 28 to 30. And it's pretty lucky. So these 4K videos are also uh, MPEG-4 AVC and uh, as you can see it's like uh, drop from 100 FPS to like 25, 26, 30 FPS just uh, for playing these videos and now I'm gonna show you same scene uh, with Bing video codec let's open it up Okay, so this is same thing, but all videos use uh, Bing video codec. So let me play it. Uh, so let me start videos. Here we go. I started uh, SD video playback, and you can see FPS is basically unaffected. It's 100. Uh, all these videos are using Bing video codec. And now I'm going to start playing 4K videos. Uh, right now you can see first frame, but they are not playing. So I'm going to start playing them. I started playing 4K videos. There are four videos. And you can see FPS drops to around 70, 75 or something. Occasionally even to 60, 60, 70, 80, it's kind of... Uh, kind of going around but even up to 90 occasionally anyway it's much much faster than uh, playing MPEG for AVC so all these 4K videos also encoded in Bing uh, with Bing video codec so as you can see it's significant in improvement compared to MPEG for AVC uh, so how do you say set it up uh, for your project uh, let me show you I'm gonna uh, right so Bing is not perfect there are some issues like when I stop playing in editor um, you can see videos are continue playing even though I'm not playing uh, in editor it sh they should stop but they don't you kind of have to stop them manually via blueprints so you had to do some blueprints scripting to stop them uh, I guess it's a bug but you no know, I can deal with it for significant FPS increase uh, so let me open another project and I will show you how to set it up so let me add a basic cube and just uh, increase size of it a little bit first uh, we go to plugins, search for Bing, Bing Media, enable it and restart Unreal Engine. Then let's create Bing Media Player. So right click, uh, miscellaneous and Bing Media Player. Let's name it a new Bing Media Player. It's fine. Open it up and we need to select media source, file or URL and we don't have any bing2 files bk2 so let's convert mpeg4 uh, video file into bing2 video file so how do we do that unreal engine comes packaged with converter 
so we can find converter in Unreal Engine folder. So it's Unreal, uh, like in your program files, Epic Games, UE5, Engine, Binaries, Third Party, Bing. Here it is. Bing 2 for Unreal. We open it up. Now we look for our MPEG4 uh, movie and select it and press Bing it. And don't change anything, just uh, press this Bing button. And now we wait and until it's done. Now it's done, uh, we can close it. And a change to a source content file has been, we don't want to import them. Uh, they will work fine without any importing. So uh, we open our Bing Media Player again and search for uh, the file we just created. And here it is, BK2 file. Open it up and we can see it playing. Uh, okay, great. Let's save it and close. Now right click on it and create media texture. And there are some settings that you you want you might want to, <clears throat> you might want to change. I I didn't change anything. Uh, right click on the texture and create material. And now <clears throat> we can apply that material to any object in uh, in the level. So just drag it and drop it. And here we go. So let's make it play manually uh, via blueprint. Open level blueprint. Create variable and let's call it uh, Bing Media Player 1 and let's select type Bing Media Player and compile it and we can select Bing Media Player in here the one we just created new Bing Media Player here it is great now drag it into level and drag wire from it and and select play here and we will do it on key press so one key here it is when player presses one we will play bing media player compile and save and let's try it out uh, i'll i'm pressing one and here we go, it works. All right, before we continue, uh, you can see it's playing in the in editor. To stop it from playing, we can uh, open player and stop it, pause it. Or uh, we can pause it manually in uh, blueprints, so like Press 2 and copy past our media player. Just play stay pause. Uh, by the way, if you try to stop it, uh, you uh, you will not be able to restart it automatically. You uh, so it's, I guess it's also a bug for now, but you will need like to call uh, initialize player from C++. Currently, it's not possible to do from blueprints, uh, from what I understand. So just don't use stop for now. Just use pause. And okay, so uh, when I press one, uh, video will start playing, and press two, video will pause playback. Uh, let's try it out. Start playing, and pause playback. Start playback, and pause playback. Okay, uh, we can see the video is a little bit dull, uh, <clears throat> so let's also change material to be emissive. So open up material and change shading model to unlit and connect uh, default RGB to emissive color. And now uh, we can see video is much brighter. And uh, when we play it, it will be brighter, even 
when it's in shadows because it's emissive also it will uh, reflect stuff on uh, like on met metallic surface okay that's it Look at the asshole, look at them. Literally me. <laughs> me ERL. <laughs> okay, that's it. Uh, don't forget to save everything. <laughs> By the way.